Dual training is always an individual physician specific choice. So everyone that thinks about it should have to really sit down before they decide that and make sure that one or the other doesn't fit them a little bit better. That's the hard part. Then comes the fun part where you get to try it out as a fourth year medical student and see if it really is for you. My decision to dual train was really, really tough. Actually it was a four year four years of decision making. When I first came to Ohio State, I wanted to do internal medicine. I loved internal medicine, thought I was gonna be you know, outpatient doctor. And through the experiences of the medical school, I worked down here for a while and realized I also loved emergency medicine. And so it was this back and forth of which one do I love more because I love both so equally. And so I finally decided to do this combined training program because I envisioned a life doing both. I really wanted training in both so that I could have the option of fellowship in both available to me at the end of training. And so for me, I knew that I had to be a part of an emergency medicine program, but I also really wanted to be a part of a pulmonary critical care fellowship afterwards. And so training in internal medicine was a natural step to get there. And I got on that train and have never looked back since. I remember when I first came here, it was really the people. I felt so welcome. I felt that everybody had had my back. Everyone was excited for me to be here. We have uh, various levels of trainees and we're all really, at the end of the day, just a big family. So we all take the time to make sure that we have each other's backs when it's important, but also spend time together outside of residency. I felt like so far this program has been really amazing in trying to make sure that I'm kind of managed in my schedules. The chiefs have gone out of their way to make sure my schedule's not burdensome. I'm, you know, no, I know exactly um, where I'm supposed to be, what I'm supposed to be doing. So at Ohio State, the residency program has some interesting initiatives that I didn't see at a lot of other places. So we have a program on the EM side where we got an endowment specifically dedicated to resident wellness. So they actually have a fund that residents have access to for both personal and professional development related specifically and only to wellness. They also allocate funds for us once a month to go do something that's not related to your academic development at all, but just something like ax throwing or team bonding events. So we have a lot of opportunities for both personal and professional development. In this combined residency, we actually switch back and forth every couple months. So we'll spend a couple months in the ED and then a couple months um, either in clinic or upstairs. And so the nice thing is that we actually get to hear about opportunities, educational opportunities, social events, no matter what rotation we're on. I think that this program has helped me a lot in trying to figure out what I want to do with my career. I, I do have an interest in critical care medicine and um, having rotated up in the ICU. The pulmonary critical care department has been so strong. It's just a wonderful place to learn about intensive care. And the same thing down in the emergency department. We are so good about um, taking care of critical sick patients. We see patients who have had various transplants, are very complicated, and also just regular people who get really, really sick. And I feel like as a team down in the emergency department, we take really great care of our patients. And it's been such a great opportunity to learn as a resident how to do that here. I like the ability to kind of be in a city aspect, but at the same time, I love the suburb feels of the neighborhoods around Columbus downtown. And I love the food scene and the brewery scene, as well as even the food truck scene. So I moved to Columbus from Los Angeles, so this was such a big change, not only from a weather standpoint, but also from just the community is just so different here. There's so many things to do uh, from new restaurants and bars, but also outdoors. Um, there's awesome bike trails, and uh, it's been really nice to get to know residents and having them having us bike together um, in and out of the city. So Columbus has just been such a great place to live this last couple of years. Having been a medical student here at Ohio State and now being a resident here, it's been such a nice opportunity to give back to the medical school. Ohio State has been a great place for me to learn so far, and I know that I've made the right decision here.